Tuesday, and that means Made in Michigan time. And I brought rice pudding this morning. Yay! Yay! It's Spilson's Rice Pudding. They've been in Monroe for over 85 years, and um, do you guys like Cam's already digging in. Yeah, I like it. And you were just saying Gia likes rice pudding. Uh, no, the Greek, Greek yogurt. Oh, the Greek yogurt. Yes, it's very popular. Babies love it and elderly love it. And um, I took a trip, so let's go and see how it's made. So now you know how rice pudding is made. Here. It's, it's very tasty. It is All really right. good. And then he also brought in um, some of the cinnamon Stacy's uh, pita chips, which are really good to almost dip in it, and are also granola. So you can kind of use it different ways. You can just eat it plain, or you can kind of spice it up and do whatever you want to do with it. So, How's it different than tapioca? Do we know? I don't know. Good question. Tapioca is more like a... Um, like a put, uh, just like a regular pudding, like a vanilla pudding with no rice, I think. My grandfather called it fish eyes and glue. My, gra my grandpa said the same thing. Fish, fish eyes, eyes and glue? And glue. Hmm. Let's That's do a tapioca pudding investigation. I, you know, I don't know what's in tapioca. Fish my eyes. grandma used to love tapioca. <laughs> I love it too. And that's good? It's very good. It's delicious. It's really good. And they're at um, all the specialty stores, like he said, like Nino Savaggio's, Westbourne Market, and I think now they're also in Whole Foods, Whole Foods too. Wonderful. So, thanks for the breakfast, Jessica. Port Michigan. Okay. Well, you probably remember his story from the movie The Blind Side, from being home.